this be okay? Oh, we need you up. Okay. Tell me how. Show me how you usually sit when you eat. See, my knee is up. Uh -huh. I've got nothing to do so with it. They have to put the I want you to sit up as straight as possible. Okay. Hi, It's a mystery substance. The fucked up is oh. the bag, but it wasn't. Okay. It's like a watery, and yeah, we keep mopping it up, and it keeps rolling out. We don't know where it's coming from. Well, hopefully it's not from you. Crazy. No, I don't think so. Hmm. It is crazy on top of me. Better. Yeah. Okay. Let me get some gloves on, and then I want to see you eat and drink a little bit. Very busy in here today. Mm -hmm. Very busy today. Mm -hmm. Everybody's making their rounds. Busy? Oh. Yeah, Danielle was here earlier to change his dressing because he had some questions about, you know, that. So the baby's foot and all that. Got it, got it. Well, so, Mondays usually are. Mondays and Fridays are usually the busy days. We've been coming on Monday and it's been so the Oh, week really? Friday. Yeah. It's been on Friday, too, we have I know. Huh. It's so weird. Well, uh, okay. We'll take it all back. <laughs> maybe I'm wrong. Okay. Or maybe we were just sit the wrong time or something. I don't maybe. Know. Maybe. I don't know. Do you typically come in the afternoon or the morning? Usually the morning. Oh, okay. Isn't I'm very surprised. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Can I see you take a couple drinks? How you normally do. Hold it or knee and help. You can't hold it too well. See, I can't get my elbow level with it. Same as this. Some things I just noticed. One, take a very large drink. That's okay, but if you're not sitting upright like I just made you do, that can sometimes make things go down the wrong pipe a little bit more easily. And two, for just this one little cookie, we took quite a long time on it. So yeah, I think usually break them in half. Usually break them in half. Yeah. So that might be where some of the staff's getting a little nervous is this tiny little cookie is a lot smaller than a big chicken breast or a grilled cheese sandwich or a salad and it's it's i mean it's kind of hard but you know if you think about it you fatigue a lot more as you eat those bigger meals even if it's not necessarily as hard as this one cookie mm -hmm. so i think i do see where the staff's getting a little nervous 
Because obviously they want you to get your proper nutrition in. Mm -hmm. We had a couple options here. One, we could always downgrade the food a little bit, make it softer, and have it cut up for you. So that would be called a soft and bite sized diet. Um, it takes away a little bit of food, like bread and salad and mixed consistencies, like a bowl of cereal. So think about that liquid with that solid all together. That can be really hard to manipulate and hold in your mouth safely. So when you go down to that diet texture, it does take away those things for safety purposes, but then it would be softer and it should get cut up for you every meal. Mm -hmm. It might make it easier to chew and swallow as well and allow you to be able to eat more without being so tired. Mm -hmm. What are your thoughts? Mm -hmm. Never really thought about it before. I know, it's kind of a weird thing. Nobody ever thinks about swallowing as something that can decline, but when he is. So at home, he tries to speed up. Uh, yeah. He tries to speed up, yeah. So and he has trouble holding things. He only drops one hand, and he's made trouble holding things, and he drops stuff. So, yeah, yeah I drops stuff easily. Yeah, I can inform away. that to occupational therapy. Obviously, you're on hospice, correct? Mm -hmm. Right. Okay. So they don't typically allow therapists to right. work with you because obviously that's more for comfort care. For therapy is yeah, not always that. Um, but what if we try the soft and bite size diet for a couple weeks? I'll come back. Maybe if I see you all in here sometime, yeah. I'll run on in again and see if I can catch you and see how we're doing with that. Mm -hmm. And I'll let occupational therapy know that you are having a little trouble. I feel like they probably are aware of that. I think they do. Yeah. I, I think, think they have that. Vicki and yeah. Danielle. Those yeah. Some of the therapists. Yeah. Yeah. So I'm pretty positive they're already aware of that, especially yeah. if that was beforehand before all of this yeah you already have a couple of that yeah but so i'll go ahead and change that diet it probably won't be changed in time for lunch right but hopefully by dinner it'll be downgraded to that softer texture of food and then that'll make it a little bit easier for you to chew mm -hmm. things like that okay does that sound fair Fine. okay all right Thank you. Thank you all for letting me take up some of your family oh, time. Oh, sure. That's all right. I saw you on the opportunity. Yeah. Okay. Thank you Thank all. You.